What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum, our severely randomized Nuzlocke episode 29. Last time we took on our fourth gym badge in Sinnoh and was given the medicine by Cynthia to come here and talk to the Psyduck. And in today's episode, we're going to talk to them and continue on. So if you're excited for another episode of Platinum, go ahead and hit the thumbs up down below and do consider subscribing to join the Domination. Now, real quick, it's a new week, and I know the music is like super turned up, but um, this series is struggling for some reason. If you're still checking it out, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for checking this out. This is our main series, so I've got to figure out how to kick it back up. Hopefully some of the other videos that are coming to the channel this week will, uh, will help with that. But let's get started with a quick team recap. First up, we have Friar. A level 36 water fighting type Rapidash holding the Quick Claw, Lax Nature with Own Tempo, with Octazooka Spore, Confuse Ray, and Sacred Fire. Then we have Sholofella, our level 37 fighting type Tyranitar holding the King's Rock, Adamant Nature with Sand Veil, with Double Kick, Drain Punch, Earth Power, and Cosmic Power. We have Nadia, our level 37 Poison Normal type Palkia holding the Choice Band, Bashful Nature with Flash Fire, with Cross Poison Cut, Signal Beam, and Fly. We have Fettlemid, the level 36 Ghost Fire type Onyx, Quiet Nature with No Guard, with Arm Thrust, Slash, Sludge Bomb, and Fire Blast. Le Next, we have Kevin, our level 25 Water Steel type Finion, holding the Experience Share because he evolves in six levels. Naughty Nature with Wonder Guard, with Aurora Beam, Giga Drain, Head Smash, and Ring Out. And lastly, we have Fabiano, the level 24 Flying type Cranidos, Hardy Nature with Soundproof, Belly Jump, Psych Up, Conversion, and Rollout. We're just praying that he gets some better moves. Now, this music is... I should have just came in here. No. This music is too much. Oh my goodness. Well, let's continue on. The Psyduck aren't, are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move. Would you like to use a secret potion? So they got a chronic headache and ran away. Ran away. <clears throat> oh good, you used the secret potion I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headaches, but no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh yes, can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandpa, to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there's some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so it'll be worth your while to go. Yep, sure. If Cynthia tells me to do something, I'm doing it. My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yes, I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. And the location, look on your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm counting on you. See you again down the road. Can we please get out of this music? Please. I'm like, I'm like begging. Oh my god. I have to turn the music down. I, I'm sorry. I have to turn, like, I mean, I have to turn the music down. Ugh. So anyway, the question of the day for today's episode is going to be... Um, this week... You'll notice, or you should notice, that there are battles that come to the channel. We're going to be doing competitive battling. Um... It's time, it's time for me to learn how to, it's time for me to learn competitive battles. Um, and I, I'm very excited to do so, uh, because I, I make very silly moves, and um, there's going to be kind of a, 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 an original twist, per se, um, to this series, in that I'm going to be taking notes, and you'll be able to see the notes in the video, and it's not going to be a series. Now, I don't think this is a new route. So I'm gonna run from this jinx, um, cause I don't, nothing has happened, but, um, what is this? Oh, a heat train, I knew that. Yeah, this definitely isn't a new route. I'm not gonna, that's, uh, that's, oh, I hate when Pokemon don't let you run away. Anyway, um, yeah, this is definitely the same as the other routes. Um, so yeah, the, there's a couple of good things to come out of the uh, us starting battles. The way we're going to be doing it, like I said, it's it's going to be focused around learning. Um, 
We're going to be taking notes on everything that we do. Um, and you'll be able to see that. So you'll be able to see the growth through learning competitive battles. I'm really excited for that. But the question of the day is... Um, There are way too many wild Pokemon in this area. Holy crap. I don't even, like, are, are there items back here? Like, I don't even want to, I don't even want to get any items. That's how bad the wild Pokemon are. It's a lava cookie. I did that for a lava cookie. <sighs> Question of the day. What Pokemon would you like to see used more? So you can say your favorite Pokemon if you want to. I mean, if you really want to, you can use your uh, you can use your favorite Pokemon as the uh, as the answer. I'm just curious. What Pokemon would you like to see more often? Whether that's in competitive battles, whether that's you know, however you want to define that. What Pokemon do you want to see used more? You know who I want to see less right right now? Is Rapidash. So I think that's what we're going to do. I don't know. Something, something's weird. Most of the time I, I feel really... It, like into videos that I record. I Right now I don't feel like I'm all here right now. And I'm not even sure why. I say it's not very effective. It's not effective. I, I can't hit anything. Oh my god. Do I really need to put defog on a Pokemon? Goodness gracious. So, I'm, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna- I'm really gonna try. Our question of the day is what Pokemon would you like to see used more often? Now, I've been watching competitive battling for quite a while, so like I've seen stuff, and like I know that Sneasel is pretty viable in the tier that he's used in. Uh, oh wait, I don't have any... I forgot that I don't have any PP left because I missed everything. Uh, what? How did you live? That doesn't make any sense. Anyway. I missed four in a row. In case you're counting. I really don't want to have to teach Defog. Of all moves. And now I'm going to have to run back through the tall grass because I, I, I want to go. I need to go heal. <gasps> I don't know. Apparently, I'm, I am not. Today is Super Bowl Sunday. I'm excited for the game. I'm going to be going to watch the game after I uh, do some competitive battling for a while. <sighs> I'm avoiding the grass at all costs right now. But like, I don't know, I've never really, the music in a Pokemon game has never bugged me before. Very strange. But anyway, I think the Pokemon I would like to see used more. You know what? I want Komo'o to be better. I was talking to one of my friends that's gonna, where am I? This doesn't make any sense. Hold on. Route 210. Okay, so that's all Route 210. It's all Route 210 all the way to Celestic Town. So forget your ideas of getting any new encounters. But anyway, I was talking to my friend who's going to be playing along. Oh god, he's at level 40.
Yay, I missed. I enjoy missing. It's fun. It makes it makes the game enjoyable to play when I miss moves. Yay. Wahoo. Oh, you don't need toxic spikes. I only need toxic spikes in uh, Pokemon Reborn. Like, should I use Defog? I feel like using Defog is an absolute waste of a, of a, like, it's not bad. Yeah, it's foggy, but I feel like I'd rather that than giving up a, I think I changed my mind. I think we'll teach Defog after this, because this is unbearable. Like I only missed, I only missed once that time. Yay! Critical hit. No, you don't need lucky chant. Shut up. It's so stupid. Oh man. Come on. Come on, Fettle Mid. Come on, Fettle Mid. You can do it. You can kill the little Ambi Palm. Alright, who wants to learn Defog? Absolute waste of a move slot just so I can learn Defog. Yes, Cranny Dose. Alright. So that means I should hit my attacks more, right? Friar's done. I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of over Friar right now. All right. Anyway, anyway, this episode has been kind of rough. I don't know if you've noticed. This episode's been a little rough. I don't know why I watched that. It's like I watched it thinking that. It wasn't gonna happen or something. <sighs> I, 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 can, I can break the fourth wall a little bit. I can break the fourth wall a little bit. This is one of those episodes that I consider and I, I don't know that I've done this before. I don't know when or anything like that, but that I consider like if I just want to scrap the episode, not because of the death, but just because of the, the tone of the episode. The tone of the episode isn't what I like. Um, and then we lose a Pokemon to Fisher immediately after I have that thought. Rock electric? I mean, all right, we're gonna pick up Nanuli, the rock electric type. And back we go. I mean, these trainers, I think I need to do a grinding montage before the next episode. Uh, but I don't know if I'll have... Nope, stop. Let, just don't even... Don't even do it. Just don't even do it. Get the fog out of here. I'm not, I'm not playing that game anymore. I'm not playing that game anymore. Because that game isn't fun. The defog, the, the fog game, that's not fun. That's not fun. Alright. That's never very effective. 
That actually wasn't very good either. I guess we're going into Nadia. Do I really have to be careful with every single Pokemon that's out when it's against a Pokemon that is higher level than it? Because I've been hit by a whole bunch of one-hit KO moves. And I feel bad for... Uh... Well, that was cool. Um... Okay. Anyway, what I was trying to say before I almost died was, uh, I don't even remember. Woo! This is... Things aren't going well in today's episode. Do I have an antidote? Thank you. And we find a safari ball. You know, I was just thinking to myself, I was like, this item, this item could turn everything around for us. It's going to be a master ball. And maybe we'll, you know, that'll make everything better. And then it turns out. And now I need rock smash. You know what? Whatever. Why not? Why not? Let, let's just kill all of our Pokemon's moves. Manuli, what do you have? Your moves are too good. Yes. Let's go Fabiana. Fabiana, your moveset sucks, so I'm gonna continue to... Surely I can get to the move deleter by now, right? I find Sing. We just weren't supposed to play Pokemon today, were we? Or we weren't supposed to play this game in particular today. I should have just, I should have stuck with the, hold on, hold on. Hold on, this looks like an area that there might be, okay, shut up with that music. Nope, nothing. Oh, jeez, man. Yay! Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Things could get better. Hold on. Hold on. Things could get better here. We only need one more level. There's nothing there. How do I get down there? Oh, I have to water... Waterfall and all that stuff. So that's probably a good item. If I was guessing, I'd say that item sitting right there is probably the really rare one. Special attack raised, and now you use try attack. Okay, thank you. I was very concerned. I know that, you know, this episode, this episode could have gone better. No. Fabiana, you go away. No, stop send, stop using moves that. All right, you know, I, this should just be a Nadia episode. That's what it should be. When when the struggles are real, it should just be a Nadia episode. Because Nadia won't let us down. We're down to... We, we've lost everyone. Yet again, we're almost down to just two people. Oh, I made it to Celestic Town. Alright, here's what we're going to do. Because this episode has been terrible. I said it. You don't have to say it in the comments below. All you have to say in the comments below is who, what Pokemon you want to see used more often. What we're going to do real quick is we're going to get... We're going to get Kevin. We only need 643 more experience. We're going to get Kevin up to level 31, so it will evolve. Or let him do it himself, because these Pokemon are... What the... You've got to be joking me. You've got to be joking me.
Okay, I'm back. I, I just had like a... I just had like a come to Jesus, like... There's a shift in there. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, that's fine. That means Shallow Fellow will be able to smack him up. Ah, I'm missing. Please. All right, here we go. Here we go. Kevin, I, I need you. I need you. learn whirlwind anyway what I was trying to say earlier was there's a shift in Solacia or in uh, route 10 where it's like into the second half of route 10 where the Pokemon are uh, much higher but we have Kevin the flying psychic type naughty nature with adaptability with Aurora being Giga Drain it's mashing me. All right. Is the music more calm out here? We're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. I know it's shorter than most, but today's episode was rough. I'm going to go cheer for the Patriots to... Ho Actually, I'm going to go stream and then go cheer for the Patriots to, uh, to hopefully win another Super Bowl. And we'll see you tomorrow for the next episode of Pokemon Platinum. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.